So I'm taking you guys thrifting with me and this is my first time doing this so we'll see how it goes um, But yeah, we're here now and today's gonna be the one dollar sale day So we're gonna do a lot of dollar sales forgot to mention that they just opened now So there's gonna be a bunch of goodies on the floor <laughs> to worry about Google kicking me out for filming in their place so um, I'm gonna go over with you guys in more details on what I bought and before we get into that I wanted to give out a small announcement I will be doing vlogmas for this month meaning that I will be creating a content per day um, for the rest of the month. I don't have too much of a schedule on what it's gonna be like. It's just gonna be whatever comes my way. So for the month of December, you're gonna be seeing a whole lot of me here. <laughs> so get used to this face. All right, so let's get started on what I got now. All right, so the first thing I got here is this maxi skirt, um, that vintage maxi skirt that I was looking at. And I was like thinking like, should I get it? Should I not get it? I did end up having a special bond with it because of the color scheme. Like I, I am loving this desert color palette right here. The fabric is kind of old. There's a lot of pilling on it, but overall it's a pretty de decent skirt. It comes with pockets, I believe. Yes, it does. And has a little pleat detailing right here. Um, just a very simple autumn desert and, you know, desert palette schemed um, skirt that I, I am like, ooh, so pretty. I see this being styled as in a very neutral toned type of way. Um, obviously the shirt that I was wearing in the dressing room did not go well with this. It went well with the, the denim shorts but not this. So it has a, it has a different uh, feel to it. The next thing I have is that denim long maxi skirt that I, I was wearing. And it fits me pretty well, um, especially because of this drawstring detail here. Um, I'm able to tie it up so it cinches me properly. Um, yeah, it's a thick denim, not the thin kind with a bunch of spandex in it. The thicker kind um, that's supposed to be very long lasting and holds up its shape. So yeah, comes with the little side slits on both sides. Oh, and it looks like it was dry cleaned before. I think that's what it was. Yeah, sometimes when you go to um, thrift stores, they have um, they have clothes that came from the dry cleaners because no one picked it up so they will have the dry cleaners tag on it alright the next thing I got is this dress um, this grey dress that I wore um, and it has a lot of buttons that's my only thing about it it's so many buttons that it's kind of annoying to take on and off um, but it's overall a very cute dress very very simple very minimal um, and monochrome I like the grey the gray palette that this comes in and another thing I like about this dress is that it comes with pockets uh, and this is great for summer wear too because the fabric is pretty much a summer wear fabric this dress reminds me a lot about Totoro for some reason it's probably because it's gray and there's like a, a certain innocence to this dress like to a person wearing it maybe that's why yeah and I also got that uh, <laughs> large culotte shorts is that what they're called? Culottes? 
yeah, it looked good and it's very large and comfy, so that's another bonus. And also comes with pockets. And I did decide on getting that jacket. I wasn't too sure if I wanted to get it or not. It's really well made. The only thing about it is that I, I wasn't sure if I wanted to get another blazer because I have so many blazers in my collection. So, um, but then the buttons kind of sold me on it. And it was only a dollar, so yeah. And then this is another thing that I got, which you didn't see in the dressing room was this shirt dress from Gap. It's just a plain black jersey knit. It's like a jersey knit. It's like a thicker jersey knit material. Um, it's just a black shirt dress. Just very simple. Um, but yeah, can't go wrong. If it's a dollar, it's only a dollar. So another thing I wanted to show you guys that was not a part of the dressing room is this dress from Silence and Noise, which I believe is from Urban Outfitters. So this is just a very simple um, dress. Partly a reason why I got it. I just I just liked it. Oh, and it comes with these like little puff sleeves. Tiny tiny puffs though. Not the overtly big puffs like um, Anna Green Gables. I ended up getting that long maxi dress. This is also another summer summer dress. It's very lightweight. Um, and this one, I'm also going to be keeping it away in the closet, store away until maybe like springtime comes out Cause yeah, no one's gonna go out looking like this right now <laughs> Look at that, it's a cute zebra print um, dress And so far I wasn't able to see any sort of defects to it So that's great That's especially true when you, when you have something of this much fabric There's bound to be like stains or rips or tears that you could miss very easily because you're just so much fabric um but yeah i haven't been able to see any so that's a good sign so that's pretty much it for the haul of today i hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys are new here uh, you could go ahead and click subscribe and make sure the bell notification is on so you get notified whenever I make new videos. And if you guys like thrifting hauls, you know, I go out shopping a lot. Um, so yeah, so until next time, as usual, much love. Peace.